Hello again, Victor here from Rescue Studio. Do real amps and classic microphones still matter? Let's find out. Today I've taken the classic Fender Hotrod Deluxe and mic'd it up with two microphones. One Shure SM57 and an Antelope Audio Verge. The Verge microphone is a modeling microphone uh, from Antelope's lineup of microphones and it emulates a bunch of different microphones, 16 to be exact. The kind people over at Antelope also send us the Centaur Synergy Core, which has this amazing feature called Reamp. That means you can take a DI signal from an already existing track, route it out of one of the two outputs on front and run it into your amp and record it through another mic. I'm also going to be covering Antelope's amp emulations to show you that you don't really need a real amp anymore. If you look over to the software, you can see that I've already added one of Antelope's amp emulations. It's a Fender-ish kind of thing, a Darkface 65 US they call it, and that should represent kind of what I have here. Should you tune your guitar before you turn on the, the cameras? Perhaps. Right now, I'm actually not hooked up directly to the Fender Hot Rod Deluxe. I'm actually running straight into the Centaur Synergy Core. Then I'm taking that signal and running it out of the R1 channel. You can see over here at the software that I'm running the DI signal into a submix. That submix is the Fender Hot Rod Deluxe. And I'm doing that with the reamp. That way I can actually reamp real time. Let me just run you through some tones. I'm going to be switching between the DI signal, the antelope amp emulations, and the two microphones in front of the amp. I will of course let you guys know what you're hearing. of the mic emulations on the Verge from Antelope Audio. 
As you can see here over at the software, I have the Verge on the Fender Hot Rod Deluxe emulating a 57. Like I said in the beginning of the video, it comes with 16 different emulations and you of course can run just straight up the Verge. As you might have figured out already, I'm going to be ABing the 57 that's already on the Fender Hot Rod Deluxe with the Verge and some of the emulations. I'm just going to be playing a bit and then I'm going to cycle between some of the emulations on the Verge.
and then back to the 57. <laughs> So that concludes every single mic emulation on The Verge. I forgot to mention before I started playing that I'm also going to be throwing in the antelope amp emulation in between the sounds, but I'm sure you guys already figured that out from the text on the screen. So what do you guys think? Can an amp emulation beat the real thing? And can a modeling mic beat an old classic? Let me know in the comment section down below, and until next time, have a good one.